had a feeling not that much longer left for the school year. I totally had that Friday feeling. I hope you do as well. But I thought it'd be kind of nice to start out our Friday lesson with a little bit of yoga because I talked to Matilda in year one and some other year one girls who said they do enjoy the yoga. So I hope a lot of you are enjoying the yoga. It may be a bit slow moving, but yoga is so good for our focus and our flexibility. Two F words for this Friday feeling, so focus and flexibility. So let's just flow through some sun salutations. Um, remember, a sun salutation is a repeated movement that we will do, and then we'll get into our Friday feeling workout, okay? So flow with me, my friends, on this Friday. We're gonna start in child's pose. So maybe you have a yoga mat. If you do, fantastic. If not, remember, you never need to have the right equipment can still follow along to the lesson. So let us just get into child's pose. So let's go towards the back of our mat if we can. Let's take our knees nice and wide and let's just reach those fingertips out and put our forehead down on the mat. We're going to take five deep breaths to find some focus. Okay, so we inhale. And as we exhale, we just let our bottom melt down into our heels. And again, we inhale. And we exhale. So every inhale, you reach those fingertips a little bit longer. And every exhale, you just let your body melt down into that mat. Hopefully this is comfortable for you. We've got two more breaths. We inhale. heels down. And inhale, we come up on our tippy toes and we exhale down. And again, coming up on those tippy toes, pushing those hands into the mat, raising those hips up to the sky and down out, pedal up those feet. Do you feel a nice stretch of the backs of your legs? I do. I really need this nice stretch. Fantastic. Now we are going to jump like a frog, our feet towards our hands. Are you ready? Bend those knees, steady, and we jump forward, and let's stand up. Oh, fantastic, I feel better already. 
give your body a little shake with a bit of a warm up. Now shall we try a little sun salutation? So this is a really common yoga flow. I wish I could make it as fun as Cosmic Kids, Kids Yoga does, but I'm gonna do our Friday flow with focus and working on our flexibility. So let's come to the end, back of the mat. And let's just stand those feet hip width apart. I'm gonna look at you. Maybe you look at me too. Maybe you shift your mat that way. Okay. So if you need to shift, that's great. Otherwise, eyes on me. Now I can see you at home. I know if you're moving with me. So we're gonna take a nice big inhale up to mountain pose. Let your gaze go up. And then hands together to heart. And you press those hands together and you come down. Let's do that again. Inhale, reach, 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 reach. Make big hands, take up lots of space on the inhale. Gaze goes up. And exhale, hands to heart. Two more. Inhale, reach. Exhale, hands to heart. Remember we link, which means we move with our breath. So we inhale with that inhale, or we move with that inhale, and hands come together in the exhale. Let's do one more. I love this. It feels so good. Opening up our chest. Inhale. And exhale. Fantastic. Fantastic. Now we're going to inhale. We're going to dive down to the ground. Yeah? Dive down to the ground. Make your head nice and heavy. Can you just let it hang there? Can you grab onto your elbows? Just let everything hang. What kind of animals hang like this? Can you think of any? Maybe an ape hangs. Their arms are really long. You just kind of move around a little bit with that upper body. Nice. All right, hands down. On the mat, if you can, if you can touch your hands on the mat, that's amazing. You're so flexible. If not, you can work on this to become a little more flexible every time you do yoga. Now we inhale, we come up our hands. This is called halfway lift. So let's walk our toes together. Our hands are on our upper thighs. You're kind of extending like a turtle. Think of pushing, like your body is your shell. Think of pushing that your head out of the shell and then bring it back. Ah! Push your head out of that shell. So you're kind of elongating your spine, elongating your spine. So turtle, inhale, and exhale, relax. And one more inhale. Reach that head away from you, and exhale. Fantastic. So let's try putting that together. Shall we put that together into a little bit of flow? So feet, feet can be either hip width apart or walk them close together. So we inhale up for mountain pose, and we exhale, hands to heart. And we inhale, we dive down. And we exhale, we come up. And kind of elongate that spine or make that spine longer like a turtle. Perfect. And roll the shoulders back. All right, should we work, put this into a little bit of a uh, inchworm now? So feet together, feet hip width apart. So feet just like this like we were before. Okay. And now we're going to go into an inchworm. So we just walk our, we dive down. And now we're going to walk our hands out into a plank. So one, two, three. Now we're in a nice plank like an inchworm. And maybe this is all you do. You just hold this nice plank. Try to make sure you make a nice alignment with your body like you're a table. But if you think you want to carry on with me, you can lower yourself down into a little bit of a push-up. And you come all the way down and you let your feet go and you come up into cobra. And so you push those hands away from you, come into cobra. And then you come back down. And you push yourself back up again into that plank. And you go into downward dog. And you remember what we do, we jump like a frog to the front of the mat, and we come up. Should we try that again? Okay. So here we are. We dive down on the inhale. 
on the exhale, we inchworm ourselves out like a worm. So we're nice and long, we come into plank. What's next? We inhale and we drop our body down to the ground. Nice and strong. We exhale, we come up into cobra. Feel the nice stretch of those back, maybe face goes up. We inhale back down. And we exhale, what do we do? We push ourselves back up. We come up into downward dog and we jump our feet forward. And we come up. Ready? Should we try to put it all together? I think we can do this. Should we try nine times, not nine, three times in a row of this sun salutation, okay? Let's go for it. I'm going to go to the back of my mat. I'm going to face this way and you're going to move with me. Okay. Nice deep breath, my friends. Okay. Here we go. Inhale, back pose. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, we dive down. Exhale, we come up, kind of like that turtle. Make your spine nice and long. Try to move that head away from you. Inhale, down. Exhale, we inchworm our way out. We hold that plank. We inhale, we drop our body down. Nice, slow and control. And exhale, we come up for cobra. Inhale, we lower down. Exhale, we curl those toes under, we push ourselves back up. Inhale, downward dog. And exhale, we jump to the front of the mat. Fantastic. And now we back, pedal back. Let's go again. That was number one. Inhale, up into that pose. Inhale, we go down. And you got it. We inchworm out, nice, slow, and controlled. Inhale, we lower ourselves down with control. So strong, everyone. Inhale, we come up for cobra. Exhale, back down. Inhale, push ourselves up. Downward dog. And we jump to the front of the mat. Perfect. One more time, okay? You're doing fantastic. How are you feeling? I feel so good. I feel so much better after doing this. Okay, inhale, mountain pose. Gaze up. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, we dive down. Exhale, let's come up for that turtle pose. Inhale, down. Exhale, inchworm it out. Hold that plank, you're doing so well. Inhale, we lower ourselves out of control. Exhale, cobra. Inhale, back down. Exhale, push yourself back. Inhale, downward dog. And jump to the front of the back. Exhale, let's stay here. Let's do two more movements. So you try a little rolling like a ball. Now that we're nice, our spines, our spine, our back is nice and open. Let's try a few rolling like a ball. So let's sit in boat pose. Oh no, boat pose. Come up into your boat. And let's just hold it. Maybe we row our boat a little bit. One, two, three, four, and five. Fantastic. Now create a nice ball. Tuck your head in. A really nice ball. Squeeze your body together as much as you can. And now find a way that you think you can roll backwards and come back up again. So I put my hands here. Are we ready? Nothing behind us we're going to run into. Inhale back and exhale up. Well done. Let's do three more of those. Inhale back, exhale up. Now your goal here, we're going to do another one and then on the fourth one, we're going to see if we can stand up from our roll. Okay, that's your challenge. So one more just for practice. Okay, on this fourth one, we're going to see if we can stand up. Are you ready? Maybe it'll take you more than one. 
give one a go. I don't even know if I can do it. See if you can do it. And then try one more time just to see. Try not to use your hands. But if you do use your hands, it's okay. But the first time I want you to try not to use your hands, okay? Just use the momentum from your body. Okay, here we go. Inhale back. Exhale. Did you do it? Try one more time if you did it. And if you need to use your hands, you can. Excellent work. Okay, I am so proud of you for a little flow. We're gonna do two balances, and then we'll move on to our Friday feeling workout. Okay, let's do airplane, because I love airplane. So we'll do airplane on the left first. So let's come up. Let's do mountain pose on one leg. So we come up, inhale. And mountain pose on one leg. Now see if it's might be tricky, but give it a go. If you can just shift your body forward and that leg goes back behind you. And maybe those arms are straight over your head. Maybe they're out like an airplane. And just see how long you can balance. If you can do 10 seconds, we're doing it really well. And then see if you can shift and come back up again. Great balance, everybody. So that was one side. Let's try the other side now. Okay, so mountain pose, inhale up. Exhale, raise that leg and just hold. So when you're ready, nice, slow, and controlled. Remember, find something to stare at on the ground. Woo, a little bit wobbly on the side. And go into that mountain, or to that airplane. And again, maybe your arms come out to the side. Maybe you grab onto a wall. Five, four, three, two, and can you come back up now? Fantastic, we had two balances in there. Great job, give your body a little shake. I hope you feel better after a little bit of our Friday Flow Yoga. Friday Feeling Workout is coming up now.